So I'm in this huge sweater because it's freaking cold. Um, it's like 18 degrees in my house and I can't turn on the furnace. So I'm wearing my dad's huge sweater and it's really, really warm. So yeah, I'm also wearing sweats and socks because I'm freezing. Hey guys, what's up? I'm doing a skincare routine today because I really like watching other people's. I think it's really helpful to look at other people's skincare routine and what products they use because there are so many from so many different brands and I'm just like, what am I supposed to buy? Like, you know, a ton of people have like facial oils and facial scrubs and all that stuff, and which I love, but I mean, I only have like five minutes to really spend on skin because, you know, I don't have like half an hour to do my whole routine. Um, I'm lazy and I'm tired, so I just do a super quick routine like in, in and out. And just for the record, I have normal skin, but I have a bit of combination kind of in my T-stone. I'm um, a little bit more oily and on my cheeks I'm a little bit more dry. Not everything that's going to work for me is going to work for you. I'm going to show you all the products here but I also have clips of me using the products so you can see what order and when I use them and how much and how and all that stuff. But basically everything I use just requires a cotton pad or your fingertips. So I'm going to show you the products. The very first thing I do every day is take the Bioderma Micellar Water. You put I put this on a cotton pad and then I just rub, rub it all over my face for two reasons. To get off the makeup and to get off excess oil and dirt. So even when I don't wear makeup in the morning, obviously my makeup, my face is makeup free unless I slept in it. But yeah, I use this to remove it first, even when I'm wearing makeup, just because I feel like if you don't remove it first, you can't really get all that second layer of makeup off your face and like that you know, I can feel it, but I didn't get everything off. So this really just like takes everything off and makes sure that I can get clean skin. After I use the micellar water, I take my beautiful Clarisonic. I got this in grade nine, so maybe one and a half, two years ago, and I've been loving it ever since. This is the Clarisonic Aria. Um, it's red. I could have gotten it in gold or red, but I thought the gold was a little bit obnoxious, so I got it in red. This is a buzzing face brush, like... I can control how vigorous the buzzing is and also the speed of the buzzing. This just like vibrates on your face and it has a timer in here so you can select I think one or two minutes and then it'll beep to go to different sections of the face, which I completely ignore because I don't have the patience for that. But it does tell you when you're done because it'll stop buzzing. So it'll be like beep beep and then it'll just stop buzzing. At first when I started using this, I didn't really see an improvement in my skin. So I was really like discouraged, kind of. I was like, everyone says this works and I was just kind of like, it's just not working for me. So it's kind of useless. But then uh, my mom kept on getting mad at me because she spent a lot of money on it, so she kept on making me use it. And I kept on breaking out by using this, and I was like, what the heck, this is- you're doing the opposite of what you're supposed to do. After a while of using it, it like, completely like, changed my skin, like when I don't use it, I'll start breaking out. Yeah, definitely give this a fair shot, like, a month of successive use, and you can't just like, use it in and out because that's not how it works. The one I have on right now is the Radiance brush. They have different brush heads. And with my Clarisonic, you have to put some soap on it or cleanser. So this is what I use, the Purity Soap. It's by the brand Philosophy. And this is a really gentle cleanser. It is really effective at taking off makeup. So I'll use the Bio, the Bioderm to take like the first layer off and then I'll use this soap with that Clarisonic to take off everything else and it's just a simple cleanser, you know, that's really have a smell to it. After cleanser, I use toner. So this is the Kiehl's Calendula Herbal Extract Toner and this actually has leaves, the things in it if you can see. That looks kind of gross, but you can see that there's leaves in it, and I've been using this for a really long time, like probably one year at least. This is a really nice toner. Um, toner kind of like just closes up your pores and like restores a pH balance in your face, 
some people are skeptical about it but i like using it it really like calms my face down and i can tell a difference when i use this toner so it has kind of like a floral scent or like nature -y scent it's not overbearing at all it's very mild the last step in my skincare routine is moisturizer so i really just do micellar water cleanser toner moisturizer so this is the moisturizer i love i use a day and a night one or sometimes i'll use the day one at night and the night one in day just if i feel like if i need some more or if i need some less so this is the less one this is the day one i like to use this is the ultra facial oil free lotion for normal to oily skin types this is super lightweight um it literally feels like water it's more of a gel than a cream like this is what it looks like and if you just rub it in it's clear but it's more of a gel and it feels really lightweight and it's oil free so the reason why i like to use this during the day is because then it won't be clogging up my pores with oil throughout the day with the makeup sitting on top um yeah so that's why i like it during the day it's really lightweight it does its job it feels refreshing so i like this and for night this is the kiehl's ultra facial cream my mom uses this more than i do but it basically is just a nice thick cream i'm like whoa i'm like out of this if you can see i had a teensy bit left a few days ago but i guess my mom finished it <laughs> but this is a really nice cream really really good for nighttime um it's rich and creamy but it's not too like you can feel it on your skin for sure whereas like this one you can't really feel on your skin but this one you can but it's not like super heavy it's just like more of a oh it's there kind of thing so these are the skincare products that i use every day okay, i'm putting down now i will list them below for you guys if you're interested in using them i hope someone found something helpful i don't know but i had a lot of fun making this video and i always clap and i'm trying to stop uh yeah i'll see you guys in my next one bye no way.